hey guys so in today's video i'm going to show you how to create unlimited facebook account without getting banned or disabled so if you want to create a lot of facebook accounts without any of the account getting blocked or getting banned by facebook let me show you how to do that so the software i'm going to be using in this video is go login i have made a full review about this software already so you can just head over to my channel and watch a review about this so you can use this software to create multiple accounts on any website so the website is not going to detect that you are using the same laptop or the same device for all the accounts so you can use it to create accounts secretly on websites and create a lot of accounts without the website even knowing so I'm going to be making use of Facebook in this video. So if you want to learn everything about the software, you can just watch this video on my channel. So let's get started. The first thing you need to do is head over to your browser and you need to search for gologin.com. I'm going to put the description, sorry, I'm going to put the link in the description also. So just head over to gologin.com and you need to click on download. Just click on download at the top right corner and you need to download the software to your device. So let me just pause it. You can also download the software for any device right here. So just select the device that you are using. You can also do this on your Android phone. But I'm not going to advise you to make use of your Android phone because it is faster and easier on your laptop. But if you have only Android phone, you can also do it. Just scan this QR code and download the app on your phone. Once you have downloaded the software to your device, we need to open it. But before I open it, there is a price tag for this. But the thing about this is that for the first week of downloading this software, you can make use of it completely for free. So you can use all the features for free for one week after creating an account. So after one week, you can now decide if you want to continue using this software. But for the first week, you can use this completely for free and test all the features and see if it is going to match what you want to do. So just check the requirements for all these offers and you're going to see the profiles you can create so with each profile you can create accounts on any website it's going to be like you open new browser for each profile it's going to be like you are using different browser i'm going to explain it to you later in this video so just choose any plan of your choice but you don't need to select any plan for the first week so just open the software or just open the app and you need to create account once you create account you are going to see something like this so you need to click on add profile at the top right corner so one thing is that you are still going to be needing proxy so there are free proxies on this app that you can use but i'm not going to advise you to make use of it because it is general so anyone that create accounts can make use of these proxies so i'm going to advise you to buy proxy from any trusted website that you know so i have made a list of trusted website that sell proxy so with the proxy you are going to change the location of your account so you can also use the profile without making use of proxy but it's not going to be safe so i'm going to advise you to make use of proxy so these are the list of trusted websites you can buy proxy at cheap price so where i bought mine that i'm going to use in this video is proxyseller.com you can also check it out they sell proxy for a very cheap price let me just head over to my account and i'm going to check my orders so as you can see this is the proxy that i just bought so this 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 is it so i'm just going to copy the proxy and i'm going to paste it in the app so you can use it without proxy with your own proxy or the go login proxy which is not safe so i'm just going to paste my own proxy right here i'm going to enter the so let's go and check 50100 50100 50100 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 50 so as you can see the proxy that i bought is working perfectly and there is no issue at all it is showing the country so right here on your left hand side sorry on your right hand side you are going to see your profile summary these are all the information 
that is going to show on your profile so it's going to be like you are downloading or you are using another browser with another information which you provided right here so let's just go to the next one which is time zone i'm going to advise you to leave all this at default so just leave it as the default settings you can just leave all this one but if you know more about this you can just change them to your choice so once you are done click on create profile right here once you click on create profile it's going to create the profile for you as you can see this is the proxy that we used and it is united states so just click on run and it's going to create a new browser that you can start using so it's going to open a new browser so as you can see it has opened a new browser so one thing i'm going to advise you to do before getting started or started start using this browser is you need to check the location so just search for my location we are going to check the location of the proxy that we just created as you can see it is washington washington dc which is united states so it is working and it is good to go so let's create a new page and let's search for facebook.com you can use it to create multiple websites on any website of your choice multiple accounts on any any website of your choice sorry so you can use it to create multiple accounts on any website of your choice but we are going to be using facebook for the sake of this video so just head over to facebook and we are going to select create new account so once you click on create new account just enter any name of your choice so let me input my name I'm going to enter my last name so you need to enter your mobile number or your email address so i'm just going to make use of my email once you enter your email they are going to ask you to re-enter the email so i'm just going to copy it and paste it just to skip those parts after that they are going to ask for a password Once you enter your password, just choose any date of birth of your choice and you need to proceed to the next step. So let me enter January 14, 19, let's select 2001. So once you are done with that, select your gender and you need to click on sign up. So once you click on sign up, it's going to load for some time. So you can just create email on this browser also. So you can just create a new tab and create a gmail account if you don't have a gmail account that you can use so i don't need to save this one let us know the email belongs to you enter the code sent to your email so i'm going to check my email right now and input the code that i received 759 759 69 so once you enter the code click on continue and as you can see, we have created account successfully. So it is still loading. Okay. And let's see. So as you can see that we have created account successfully and it is now done. So we can now start using this account. As you can see. So in order for you to create multiple accounts, all you have to do is create a new profile. So as I've said earlier, you can use this for free for one week. So just click on add profile at the top right corner buy a proxy on any website that i have listed right here so just buy any proxy of your choice i'm going to address you to make use of this website also it is also good so just buy proxy and once you buy proxy copy the information and paste it in your go login so you can just check youtube how to buy proxy or just learn how to do that because i don't want this video to be long so once you have created profile you can start using the account and one good thing about this is that they are not going to ban the account or anything you are not going to face any issue with this account trust me guys so i don't know where i can check the location of the account but it's going to be united states so let's check your information let's see so let's check profile details so let's click on ok So this information, I don't know where I'm going to check it, but 
the account is going to be united states as you can see that we have checked it earlier so if you have any question about this just drop them in the comments so just create a new profile let's check the go login so just create a new profile once you create a new profile you can also use it to create an account on different websites so just keep creating new profile that you can use so once you are done with each profile just click on stop it's going to close the profile you can also start it at any time if you have any question about this drop them in the comments down below and don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel thanks for watching guys